Hey guys, Dan the Wolfman for ProMMAnow.com with the only one and only Kaz Lugano. How's it going? Great, how are you today? Good, I'm doing good. Did you enjoy the matches tonight? I absolutely enjoyed them. I really needed to come here and see this stuff today. The the talent here was incredible and I got to see some of my favorite fighters and even meet some of them, so yeah. it was really fun. What did you think about Shinya Aoki getting submitted rather quickly? Oh, I'm a big fan of both of them, but um, stylistically, I, I really look up to Aoki, so I am um, I'm bummed. I'm sorry. Yeah, I was surprised. Yeah, right? I mean, how quick it was, too. Yeah. So I, the other matches, there was a couple of pretty kind of boring, but it was a couple that were pretty good. Yeah, one of my, uh, Brendan Schaub was here. Um, he's from Colorado. He's a, I actually work out with him, too, so I was, I was happy to come and the see him. The crowd was too. really rough on him. I know. It's, you know, it's it's a, it's a transition, so it's okay. Yeah, I, 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 I think if you, you, you can't complain about it unless you're willing to engage on the feet to see what position it happens anyway. I don't agree with butt flopping, never will, and, and, and think it's wrong. But well, but, you know. You should know the, the judo game. I mean, yeah. they should, they should do, try the judo game or go into a submission off of the clinch. Right. You know? Well, anything, anybody that's willing to get in there and fight, you know, it's 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 tougher than sitting in here in these seats and watching. So, yeah. you know, so what do you think, no matter what. What do you think about Misha Tate now getting this shot after you whipped her butt? Um, you know, no it's, offense, Misha. it's disappointing to not to not have <laughs> not have uh, you know the opportunities that I, I worked so hard for, you know, and have everything just kind of fall through my hands. Um, but you know, Dana was really comfortable. And, and made sure that you know I'm taken care yeah. of really well and that I have the best surgeon and and going home to the best physical therapy possible and I'm healing up fast That's above good. average recovery right awesome. right now so did good. you know how bad it was her right away because like I don't think UFC said they didn't know to like uh, March 14th and they didn't announce it to like the 26th or the 28th or something like that so I I didn't want to say anything because I think I could have done it anyway, you know. Right. Um, Every I, athlete wants to think that they're I, okay, but... Yeah, I just, um, you know, I, I, I was jumping over some like like 8 to 12 inch hurdles, just, you know, resetting squat jumps, and um, they were really simple, done them a ton of times, would do them again, but uh, just came down weird this one time and um, completely blew out my knee, yeah. and uh, then... Yeah, now I'm just waiting. Do you think it's it's all right that Misha got it because she was in the number one contender match, or do you think it should have went, went to a woman coming off a win? I was really curious who it was going to be. I mean, Dana told me ahead of time, he's like, I got to put in Misha because it was the winner of our fight that was going to get to coach okay. the show. So I understand by default, you know, that's that's her place right now. So I would have preferred Sarah McMahon or someone else coming off a win. I was thinking it was going to be Sarah. I honestly but was. But I guess it will happen so was, in the future. I was caught off guard, you know. But you're, you're told you'll still get the shot once you heal, heal yeah. up, right? Yep. So. All as well, yeah. you know, we'll work out. Yeah. It might give you some time to just think about, you know, probably now you're probably just thinking like crazy about <laughs> different positions or combinations or what. I mean, is your brain racking or are you like enjoying I'm eating? Kinda, and I'm kind of chilling, chilling, you know, relaxing. Like I was working really hard to get ready for all of this and, and my like mentally was getting really prepared for all this too. So yes. now it's, I mean, a complete backflip. I'm, I'm laying in a bed for eight to ten hours a day, you know. And Well, we got, we got what, Alexis Davis has got a fight coming up. That, that's, that should be an exciting match. Yeah, that'll right? be a great one. Um, and then uh, Julie Kezzi's fighting someone, I think, a couple cards later, mm -hmm. a card later. So. And then you have Liz Carmouche, too. She's coming up with July now. Yeah, so. I didn't know who they were going to do with her because she was scheduled originally to fight Misha, so I didn't know who they, yeah. if, if they rescheduled so, her. So they brought, right. they brought her in a girl from Brazil, a really oh, tough cool. girl. See? You should do the media stuff. You're pretty good at this. <laughs> Thank you for that. And um, anything else you want to say or plug your Twitter or you and your husband's website or anything like that? Um, you know, just visit us at ZinganoBJJ.com and you can find out any kind of questions, any information you need to know there. All right, guys, go to PromoMainNow.com and subscribe to my YouTube page. Thanks. Right. Cheers. Thank you. Thanks. Appreciate it.